right, it's on the rose here. I want to share something like I did the other day that's a little bit more different and upbeat to all the sad news that's currently going on. So let's have a look at another lot of Australian words that I didn't seem to mention those heaps, like literally heaps. So let's have a quick go, okay? A book is a book shot of a library is someone's a bit stupid. An egg shot of a dozen, as above, it's like a um, six pack shot of a carton or a noodle shot of a stir fry. A penny shot of a pound is someone who's not quite there. A snag is a sausage shot of a barbecue, as above. A can shot of a slab, simmer. A grape shot of a bunch is, um, you know, they're not quite there. A sandwich shot of a picnic, as above, they're not they're not fully there mentally. Stubby shot of a six pack I mentioned. A bitch on heat is a woman seeking casual sex. Or they call them F buddies. Yeah. Um, Akadaka is slang for hard rock band ACDC. You know, Thunderstruck, you should be all night long. Um, Aces, that's excellent. Um, if you stubby shot of a six pack is not quite there in the head, yeah. Aerial ping pong is Australian rules football. After dark, sharks. So, yeah, sharks were culled years ago and now they're making a comeback. Okay, so aircon is air conditioning. Airy fairy is ambiguous or vague. Agro is aggressive. All the go is fashionable. Amber fluid is beer. Ambulance is an ambulance person, paramedic. Ankle bite, a small kid, you know, small enough to bite your ankles. Ape shit is an expression of extreme anger. Also means going crazy. Apple eater is a Tasmanian, or we call Tasmanians um, two heads, uh, because years ago they had a thyroid problem and they grew a massive lunch uh, lump, and it was something to do with some sort of deficiency. And now they put that stuff, that mineral, in the salt straight away, so no one goes through that again. Okay, an arse licker is someone who tries to befriend you but is not really genuine about it. Okay, arse over tit is generally when you're drunk and you fall over something. Um, you trip over something because it's unexpected. Arse wipe is an idiot, so someone runs into you, you call them an arse wipe. Arvo is afternoon, as obvious as dog's ball, which is oblivious, obvious. Um, as popular as the rattlesnake and a lucky dip means not popular. As scares as a hen's teeth. Hens don't really have teeth, so it's very rare. As useful as a third armpit, useful, useless. As useless as a set of tits on a bull. Um, bulls don't have them, so pretty useless. It gets used quite a lot, that saying. As useless as a one bike, it's completely useless. Okay, attack on the bunchies is hungry. Avo, Avo is avocado. Aussie, short for Australian, or we call them Australia. Um, Aussie salute is waving the flies, you know, on stop for five seconds. Um, Australian kiss or Aussie kiss is just like a French kiss, but down under, <laughs> if you know what I mean. B is back at Burke, which is somewhere isolated. It's almost sort of, it's between, uh, Queensland, nor, you know, northern sort of New South Wales and South Australia. So this is what the little town of Burke looks like. You drive through, you blink it, you'll miss it. You know, it's got a couple of pops. Oh, you, yeah, you blink and you miss it sort of town. So this is what they mean by out the back of Burke. It's in the middle of nowhere. There's nothing out there. Very close to the borders of New South Wales. Uh, Queensland, Northern Territory, South Australia. Okay, so this is Queensland, I live right here, so this is where Burke is, and this is what I mean by so close to all the borders, so Queensland, New South Wales, and South Australia, this part here is called Cameron's Corner. Lately, there's a lot of people trying to, you know, break the quarantine and border rules, and they're going this way, um, and there's a uh, etching in grave they found in 1988 called the Mari Man, I'll show you um, I have mentioned this Murray man ago, but this is what it is, and it's basically, he's pointing a woomera 
you saw like a spear at the Woomera test range and Pine Gap piece. So, yeah, discovered in 1988, but lots of people are taking that back way and not ending up in good situation. Okay, so a backdoor bandit is a gay person. Barkhander, a bribe. Oh, backhander is a bribe. Bag, to criticise, you know, to run down. Bail is to cancel something like your plans or even a date you didn't really want to go on, so you ring up and say, like, I'm going to bail tonight. Uh, ball and chains means you're married or your balls are in the jar beside the bed. Um, balls is testicles. Ba banana bander, someone from Queensland. Uh, banter is to exchange of teasing remarks, not to be offensive, more sort of playful backwards and forwards sort of picking on someone and running them down as far as you can go without sort of starting an all-out fight. Barrack is to support your sports team. Barry Crocker means shocker. You know, like, what a Barry Crocker. Shocker, mate. Uh, basket case is a crazy person. Bastard is a term and a demon for your best friend often. Your best friend is a total bastard, but your worst enemy is a little bit of a bastard. So your bathers are your swimsuit, or we call them togs, or cozy is another word, but we don't really call them swimsuit. Not really bathers, but it's more so togs. Um, Bazer is Barry, break is nose, belter is really good or excellent, bean counter is an accountant, bearded clam is a, yeah, I don't really want to say that word, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> um, beat around the bush is someone who says a lot without saying something and they're not really telling you the full story, so they're beating around the bush there. Telling you furfies, furfies is like white lies. Uh, Butte is the best. Beer goggles is what you get when you drink too much alcohol. You start viewing unattractive members of the opposite sex as gorgeous. <laughs> beer gut is a fat stomach, or what we call uh, be a bevan is someone who likes cars, a bit of a hoot. So, ah, oh, you're a bit of a bevan, are you? But a bevy is a beverage, like uh, a beer or wine when you go to have a, a drink at the pub. Um, beyond the back stump is <laughs> see the back of Burke, which is what I just showed you out in the middle of nowhere. Bible basher, a very religious person. Big knob, someone in up in a big unit, a large person. Um, big note oneself is to brag about their achievements or their features or, or how how they made it to their high up job. Big smoke is a very large city that's often polluted. Um, a bikey, bicky. Biscuit, biggie, yeah, biggie biscuit. We don't call them um, cookies, we call them biscuits. Uh, bin chicken um, is the ibis. Is there a native bird that hangs around? Rubbish bins looking for an easy feed. And they're really annoying. When my son was four year old, he was sitting down at South Bank in Brisbane and he had a um, six inch subway and this bin bird flew along and snatched the whole Subway out of his hands and the poor little fella just started crying. But the really nice lady at Subway gave him a replacement, which was really sweet. So, but these bin birds, nasty. Okay, um, Bingle is a bit of a motor vehicle or car accident. A bit of a yarn is to have a chat or a talk or a chat. Like tin wag is another one. Or have a chat is someone that just never shuts up. They're always having it. So, yeah, it's like, are you going to have a chat or are you going to come? Okay, bite your ass means shut up, be quiet. Bites, insect, being bitten by insects like ants, mozzies. Mozzies are mosquitoes. Bizzo is business, blind, drunk, blind Freddy is to the point something delivers. Libius, I even blind Freddy could have seen that. A block is a head, a bloke is a man. Bloody oath means that's true. Um, blotto is drunk. A blower is a telephone. And another thing is, you ask young kids these days to show how you would go to call someone and sign them, they'll go like this. You know, but back in the day, we would go like this. Uh, blowy is a fly. Blowing is an uninvited person that just will not leave. So, you got a rally that's come and they just can't take your hint, you call them the blowing. Blowing the bag is an alcohol, alcohol breathalyzer test. Um, 
undertaken by the coppers, which is police or jacks, when they pull your, your car over on the side of the road, generally red and breath test is a little thing. Sometimes you don't have to blow in the bag, you just count from 1 to 10, and it can read the amount of alcohol in your blood. And in Australia, it's 0.05, it did start as 0.08, but there was still a lot of road accidents, so they lowered it to 0.05. Um, blow me down is an expression of astonishment. Bludger, a lazy person who doesn't want to work, so you call him a dull bludger is someone who receives government benefits. Blue healer is another word for a policeman or a cattle dog. Uh, Bluey is a red-headed person, see Ranger. Um, Blunnies is blunderstone boots. Bordies is board, board shorts that you wear into the ocean or water, it's worn by surfers. Uh, Bobby is a glass of beer in Western Australia. Um, pint is another one we call it. Uh, Bodgy is something that refers to an inferior quality. So you get someone in to do work on your house and it's a bit shaddy, so you call it Bodgy. Uh, Bogan, a redneck, uncultured, unclothed, unclothed person or someone who doesn't shower, doesn't take pride in themselves or their house. Bogged is stuck in some very deep sand or mud, you know, in your car or your four wheel drive. We call them 4x4, four four, not so much 4 wheel drive, but 4x4. Four four. Bogged in is to launch into eating a lot of food very quickly with a ton of enthusiasm. Bogus is fake. Boil over is an unexpected, unexpected result, usually in a sporting event um, where the underdog wins. So you place a bet, and you, you say the horse races are on, your horse doesn't win, so you, you boil over. Bollocks, uh, testicles. Yeah, a bomb is an old car. So anything that's sort of 15, 20 year old is classed as a bomb. Um, bombed, high on drugs, boobs, breast, buffet, a fool, bonnet, a cook the hood of a car. A Bondi cigar is a piece of poo floating in Australia's most famous beach, also re referred to as a brown eyed mullet. Bonk means sex. Bonk buddies is casual partners, F buddies. Bonkers is crazy or nuts. Bored shitless is extremely bored. Um, bonds are awesome. Boot the car. Um, booze bus is when police used to catch drunk driver. Boozer is a pub, so Walk Creek, uh, Creek Hotel. Bottle -o, uh, bottle -o, a bottle -o is excellent. Bottle -o is a bottle shop to buy liquor, alcohol, and you have to be 18 to buy alcohol. Although, if you're under 18, you can drink at home as long as you have an adult or a guardian that is over 18 and you don't leave your home. So, brass rezo means you have no money. Uh, bread basket is stomach. Brecky is breakfast. Bricky is bricklay. Brick shit house is something that's very solid or well built. Bris Vegas, the city of Brisbane. That's where I live. Um, broke means no money. A brolly is an umbrella. Brown eyed is anus. Um, Bruce, an Australian man. Google the Monty Python sketch about it. Brumby is a wild horse. Uh, we used what I think they were wheelers in World War One, and we've got a lot of them out in the bush now. Bubba's baby. Um, Buckley's chance means you got no hope. You got no Buckley's chance in hell of getting a dollar from me. Bucks party party. Budgie smugglers are the trunks that looks like a guy is transferring a small bird in. <laughs> Bugger is bad luck. Um, years ago there was a at, I think it was Toyota, and the dog done something with the ute, and the bloke crashed into several things, and all he could say was bugger, and it was just so funny, it was just, everything was bugger, bugger, okay, so bugger all means none or nothing, bugger means is, um, I'm surprised, bugger off means get lost, but Buggerless is a term and demon for someone you want to annoy. Buggerlugs, yeah. So, if someone is annoying the shit out of you, you go, piss off, buggerlugs. Um, buggered is tired, seed stuffed. Um, uh, buggery, a uh, place of male prostitution or generally the male toilet box of a public toilet in a park on a weekend. Um, bullshite is a lie or total crap. So, Someone's lying to you say, oh, you better wipe the corners of your mouth as there's still some bullshit left there. <laughs> um, did a lot. A bum is butt. Bum fluff is facial hair. Excuse me. Um, bung to put somewhere. 
Plumbing somewhere. Just bunging in the oven. Plug up a hole. Cover mouth. Burning the midnight oil means staying up for a long time to get something finished. Um, Bushman's clock is a kookaburra, a native bird. A bush pig is <laughs> under track to form it all. We call them swamp, donk swamp donkeys as well. Um, busier than one armed bricklayer in Baghdad. It is extremely busy. Think of it as one. <laughs> Think of this one as a mental imaging. You'll get it. So, oh, one armed bricklayer. Um, busted means something is broken. It also means that you've been caught in the act of doing something you shouldn't be doing. Bust up is an argument. Butcher is a very small glass of beer, normally only in reference to South Australia. BYO is bring your own alcohol, otherwise you might see this on a party invitation because no one wants to pay for your beer or your alcohol. A cabbie is a cab driver. Cab slab is a shortened version of a grape variety. Cabin, cabernet Sauvignon. A cactus is broken or useless. So, oh god, that's cactus. Means it's broken. Cake hole mouth, call it quits, call it a day to stop. Camel, promiscuous person, someone who has a lot of humps. Um, a camp is a homosexual. Cancer stick is a cigarette. Or they'll say having another nail or putting another nail in the coffin. Um, cane toad is someone from Queensland. Cans is breast. Canac is Canadian. Can means come on. Cardi is a cardigan, which is like a jumper like it's not a heavy jumper it means to dye cat's pajamas that's something that's really excellent this cat's piece is very bad wine and it's generally unlabeled shit um charge like a window pool is a place that charges very high price chat to talk cheapest chips very cheap check out chip Cheek, a supermarket cashier or clerk. Cheeky, someone who shows a lack of politeness to a lovable way. Cheerios is a small sausage consisting of mystery meat. Well, the mystery meat is ears, tails, hooves, uh, faces, all that kind of stuff. Generally, it's pork and their little red things. Um, cheesed off is annoyed or pissed off. Chick is a girl. Chick flick is a movie usually women like. Romantic comedies, etc. Chinwag is a very long discussion, or like I said, have a chat. Uh, a chippy is a carpenter. Chip chat talk. Chocky blocky is a chocky bicky is a chocolate biscuit. Chockers or chocker block is very full of food. You've eaten too much dinner, so you chockers. Chocky is a chocolate. Chook is a chicken. Chooks is the plural vision version. Chrissy is Christmas. Chrome down is a bald man. Chucker lefty is please turn light right. Left. Chuck a righty is please turn right. Chuck a spaz is to become really mad or angry for like no reason, really fast, like just come out of the blue. Uh, Chuck a Yui, please do a U turn. Chuck a spew, so you're in the cab, you've been out night clubbing all night and you're on your way home and you feel like you're going to throw up, so you say to the cab driver, you say, Oh, pull over, I'm going to chuck. Um, Chunder. So, to vomit when you're really drunk, chew and spew is fast food, chewing the fat is having a talk, chewy chewing gum, sicky cigarette, clap is gonorrhea, that STD, it's used in contact, contact, so I've got the cup, clapped out, broken, click is a kilometre, we don't use miles, we use kilometres, kilograms and litres, not, um, you know, pounds and gallons, uh, clod heads, hoppers are your feet, Clucky is a woman who feels maternal on heat wants a baby. Codinger is a Sydney Harbour Bridge. Cobber is a fancy mate. Uh, cocky is a cockatoo uh, native bird. There's also white with yellow, like on the feathers, and then there's also black with red cockatoos that are up north. A cockroach is someone from New South Wales. A coldy is a cold beer. Codswallop is total rubbish, which means it's bullshit, not true, made up. Come Augusta means made a very big mistake. Come to blows is to fight. Crunch, conchy, someone who is a conscious person. Congrats is congratulations. Uh, cooktop is stove. Coppers is policemen or jacks. Um, we used to say, what's a one cent coin made of? Copper, copper. What's a two cent coin made of? Copper. Because they are one or two cent coins made of copper. Um. Corker means something that's excellent. Couldn't be bothered. Didn't want to do something. Cosy swimsuit. We, we said that. We don't really say that. We say togs. Um, crabs is pubic lice. So you see 
you go to your mates and then, you know, you've been partying all weekend and you go to have a chat and you go, oh, that Sheila gave me the crabs, you know, all the blokes do anyway, that's how they talk. So, um, cracker fat is to grain in an erection known as cracker fatty or a stiff, cracker stiffy. Uh, cranky is someone who's in a really foul mood and you just give them a wide clearance. Crack onto someone is to pursue someone romantically that you like them. Crapu is toilet. Another word is brasco. Crawler is someone who tries to get on the right side of people in a non-genuine way, similar to an arse licker. So they sort of suck up and, and crawl up and go out of their way to do things to please you. Creamed is uh, to defeat the opposition team in a very big margin. Crikey is an expression used when you're astonished about something saying it was made famous by Steve Irwin. A croc is a crocodile, the biggest croc caught in Australia. There are some huge crocs in Australia. Crook means you're sick, you know, you go to your boss and, oh, I feel crook is, got a stomach ache, you know. Uh, cross country wrestling is rugby league. Cow eater is someone from South Australia. Crown jewels is your gen gen uh, genitals or the family jewels. Uh, cruddy is very poor quality of, like, say, someone does some work in their house and they ask, what do you think of it? You say, it's cruddy, it's poor workmanship. Crybaby is an adult who becomes easily upset, similar to a sook. Uh, a cub is a crushed up bogue and an unclothed person. Cubby house is a playhouse for children. I think overseas they call them tree houses, we call them cubby houses. Um... Oh, I'm not sure what that one is. Oh, it might be cunt, a turn of a demon for one of your closest friend. Cuppa, cup of tea, cut lunch sandwiches, curly, a bird ball person. Cut someone's grass means to hit on someone's wife or husband or go and sleep with someone that's got a partner already. So it's cutting one's grass. Um, Dad and Dave is a rhythming slave for shave. Dad and Dave was a popular radio show, so I'm going to say, I'm going to have a Dad and Dave means shave. I'm going to shave my face. Dag is an efficient term. For, no, we don't use Dag. I spoke to someone about that before. I mentioned this in the last video. We don't use Dag. It's not something we use. Dags is poo on your trousers. Dax is pants or tra trousers. We call them tracky dacks. Um, Dags, yeah, I don't, don't know. Dawn Stubby is the largest bottle of beer in the world. It holds 2.25 litres of beer from the Northern Territory. Date is your bum hole. Dazza is Darren. Um, another one is Shazza or Sharon. Um, Liz is Lisa. Um, we, we shorten so many words. It's, yeah. Uh, Dazzler is a very good looking person. Dead Cert is shortened from Dead Certainty like you Dead Set. Dead horse is rhyming slang for tomato sauce, so you're at the dinner table and you want some tomato sauce, you say, can you pass the dead horse please? Um, dead marine is empty beer bottles, dead ringer is exactly the same, exact copy, similar to the German term Doppelganger. Dead set is genuine, authentic, deer is expensive, not like a deer is in an animal, but deer is... Jeez, that is expensive. Death trap is extremely dangerous. Unroathy car, more likely to cause your own death or kill others. Deep and meaningful means an important conversation with someone you know. It's also as a DM name. Defo is definitely a Dero. Someone who's a derelict. Derelict is bum that doesn't take care of oneself or doesn't have a place to live. Homeless. Devo is devastated. Dial is face. You know, like say you're off your dial means you're off your face. A dickhead is an idiot. A dill is an idiot. Dingers is condoms. Um, yeah, or another word is um, rangers. Um, mainly called rangers or love gloves. A digger is an Australian soldier. Um, din dins is dinner. Uh, dingling is a very singly person. Dingling, silly person. Dinky die is gender and fed income. Yes, true. Dipstick is an idiot. Loser. Also, dipstick is on your car where you check your oil. Dirty to be really angry. Like, I'm dirty that this has happened. Um, Divi van is a police wagon where you transport in the back of the police station. Um, it's also called a dog box. You know, I don't know why, but we call them a dog box. Okay, so in Australia, this, well, mostly across the whole... Australia. This is what our police vans, paddy wagons look like. A lot of them are different, but they mainly look like this. 
and they're called dog box because you get thrown at the back of them. Um, they have these in the Northern Territory because it's so hot. Um, these are the dog squad ones mainly. So, yeah, that's why they're called dog boxes. And so, yeah, just showing that one. Okay, another one is DOB, is to dob someone in, to report someone or provide com confidential information on someone else. Or another one is people who dob in information about crimes to the police. They're called narcs. Um, so yeah, they're narcs. Docket is a receipt or a bill. Doco is a documentary. A dog is an unattractive woman. Dog and bone is rather than slave for a phone. So can I use your dog and bone when you finish, please? This means can I use your phone when you finish? Dog's breakfast is a total mess. Think about it when a dog wakes up in the morning and looks into his messy bowl. A dog's eye is a rhyming slang for a meat pie. A uh, doll is unemployment benefits for the Australian from the Australian government. Doll bludger is someone who on unemployment benefits who doesn't want to get a, get a, look for a job. Um, Donna Steve Bradbury is fortunate to win something. Steve was the first Australian gold medalist at the Winter Olympics. He won the men's short track skating because everyone in front of him fell over and he crossed the line first. Good on him, though he deserved it because he tried. He's got trained his guts out for you. He's got tried. I think it should be because he trained, he's got the fear. A donger is a penis. Um, or another one is a donkey. Uh, donkey's years is a very long time. A doodle is a penis. A dooner is a duvet. Dodgy is not something, it's quite not quite right, or a shady character. Dosh is money, or mula, or bugsy is another term for money. Doe, money. Do your block is to lose your mind, lose your temps, I'm thirsty. Drink with the flies is to drink alcohol by yourself. A drongo is a dumb person. A drop bear is a mythical um, creature locals describe to tourists uh, where bears drop out of trees and injure people. This is what they say drop bears are, but sorry, they're not. They're just koala bears. And if you go reporters dressing up for drop bears they put on all sorts of crazy stuff and it's unreal um drop kick is an idiot dropping the kids off at the pool is taking the dump so mum's in the kitchen cooking fish and chips dad's in the toilet bombing battleships <laughs> um a druggie is a drug addict a drumstick is a chicken leg drunk is a skunk is obviously drunk a dummy is a pacifier for a baby uh dud root is somebody who's bad at sex or a potato sack means they're not a good route. Don't know is a shortened version of I don't know, so you get asked where the keys are. I don't know. Um, Dunny is a toilet. Dunny driver is a plumber. A durry is a cigarette you roll yourself. You know, you roll your own tobacco. Ear bash is to non-stop talk when you're in trouble. You get an ear bashing from your parents. Ear bash is someone who talks to you non-stop. Um, easy campsite. Campsy, it's really easy. Davy Campsy used to be an Australian rugby player. Um, easy on, slow down or calm down is like easy on. Um, elbow grease is hard work to do. Scrubbing is a bit of elbow grease. Empties, empty beer bottles. Hopefully you're the one that consumed the beer out of them. Not me, sorry, I don't drink. Um, even Stevens means you're even at whatever you're doing, um, where you don't owe each other anything. Every dog will have its day is your time will come eventually. So generally if someone's been called a dog, it means that they've dobbed on someone and that they've caused trouble for the other person. So the person that was dobbed on will turn around and say every dog has its day it means that he will get caught. So Esky is a cooler box. We mentioned this before. Exy is expensive. Face fungus is facial hair. Faceless is drunk. Face drop. <laughs> Like a drop pile, um, Facey is slang for social network site Facebook, but some people mainly call it Facebook because you wouldn't tell your neighbour when you're having a shit, and yet so many people write down so much personal stuff that you wouldn't tell your neighbour. So a fag is a cigarette or a nail in the coffin. Fair don't come true. Honest owner and fair go mate means you want to be treated fairly. Fairy is a gay person and fair fucking fantastic is that's excellent can also mean that's bad depending on the context. Fanny is your vagina, it's not your ass. Um, fight ass around is a waste of time, you're procrastinating. Feral is a badly behaved person. Um, Festy is something that smells off or is decomposing, so you, 
say you got a scar or a wound and uh, you have stitches and you're gonna have dressings done and they open it up and you get that bad whiff, that's, that's something festy. Um, so, we've done fig jam is, if I'm good, just ask me. Someone who's up themselves has a very high, high opinion of themselves, which is not warranted, substantiated by others. You might know this person at work. Um, I'll leave a link in the description for a song about that. Filthy is really disappointed. You know, like, I'm filthy, you didn't go ahead and do it. Findic is a surfer, or a skeg. Skeg is another word for a surfer. A fiery is a fireman, a fisher is a fish and chip shop. Fire is a $5 note, or an echidna is another word for a $5 note. Uh, fizzer is a failure to disappoint, or a disappointment. Flat chat is full ball, doing something very quickly, so you flat chat, I'm out of time, hurry up, what do you want? Um, flat out like a list of drinking is very busy. A flatty is a flat tire. A flick is to get rid of something. Um, flicks is the movies. Flick it on is to turn something on, like the television, idiot box, or radio. Flog the log is to masturbate. Or feed, um, the chooks, for, generally for women. Or, um, visit Mrs. Palmer is another one the men use. So, um, Flog in the place, good person who loves gourmet food. Footy is football, usually refers to Australian rules, football, or aerial ping pong. A fox is an attractive winged woman. A franger is a condom. A freckle is your anus. A freebie is something that is free. Um, Frenchie is a condom. Freshie is freshwater croc. Frog is a Frenchman. Front up is to turn up somewhere. Frosty is a very cold bottle of beer. Frothy is beer. Um, another word for frothy is when you're really pissed off, like, my dad would, like, just look at him and he'd go, go away, I'm frothy, which means, go, I'm not in the mood to talk. Um, fruitcake is a crazy person, fruit loop is a crazy person, if me dead means that's really surprising, like, fuck me dead. Um, fugly is a mash of two words, which is effing ugly. Uh, full of piss is meaning drunk, full of beans, high energy, fully sick is excellent, fun bags is breast. Funny farm is the mental asylum. Fur burger is your vagina. Fur is a rumor. White lie. Gabba is the Brisbane cricket ground. Loading in Brisbane suburb of Wollong Gabba. Galar is the native Australian bird, but the slang version means a person that is a noisy idiot. It is a galar. He just will not shut up. You know, he's got to be um, the center of attention. So look at that galar. Uh, Garbos or Garbologist is a garbage person who collects rubbish. G'day is good day, hello. Get a Guernsey is to receive a ward. Get a wiggle on is I need to keep moving. Um, get on your goat is you're really annoying me. Get your hand off it is stop talking crap. Ginger beer, rhyming slang for engineer. Give it away is to give it up. Give it a bell, let's try this. Give someone a bell is give someone a call on the phone. No, you, you know, voice call, not SMS. Um, give yourself an octopus is, give yourself a wank, uh, masturbate. Goalie is a gob. A goanna is a rhyming slang for piano. A uh, gob is mouth. Gobful is to abuse someone. Gobsmack to surprise. Goes down like a lead balloon is a failure. Going off like a frog in a sock is going crazy. Going off like a bucket of prawns in the sun is going smelly. Going tropo is going crazy. Usually in the heat of the tropics is... Good oil is useful information or just something that is very good in general. Uh, goodies is treats. Good sport is a good person. Uh, grog is um, as full, once again, another crazy word for drunk. Uh, good on you is great. Oh, goon bag is one that comes from silver bladder. A goose is an idiot. Go on walk about means going traveling, going for a walk with that, you know, a bush walk. Granny flat is a detached building next to your house where your grandmother or your grandfather might live when they're with you or where a young adult lives when they don't want to move out of home so they move into the back. The parents build a granny flat to get them out of the house so they get some privacy. That's generally what it is. And then the kids take over the house and kick the parents out into the granny flat. Um... Green death is Greek, uh, Victoria bit of beer. A greenie is environmentalist. Gregory Peck means neck. Grog is alcohol, beer, wine, anything alcoholic. A grommet is a young surfer. A grouse is grouse is terrific. Um, grub is food. Grundies is underwear or un, undies or underwear that men say. Women say knickers. Um, gut full of pisses drunk. Gutless wonder is a coward. A gyno is a gynecologist. 
Half-assed is a job that's not completed, no such term as a full ass or finished job. Um, hangry is hungry at the same time. Happy is the two tails, extremely happy. Hard yakker is hard work. Have a blue is to have a fight. Have a captain cook is to have a look. Have a go, your mug is you're not trying. Have a lash at it, you have to try it. Something heaps is a lot of something. Hens, eat, hens fruits is eggs. Hens night is a women's bachelorette party. Herb is marijuana. Um, he, another one's ganja. Um, Hicks is people who live in the country. Hicksville is a remote town where Hicks live. Never really heard that one said, sorry. High as a kike is high on drugs. Hit the frog and toad is going for a drive on the road. Another one is a frog and toad is um, a slice of bread. You take a little circle bit out. You crack an egg into it. You put it in the fry pan. Like you put the bread in the fry pan. You take your whole out, crack your egg in it, cook it and flip it over. That's also called a frog and egg as well. A hoodie. A holly is a holiday. Uh, holly dooly is an expression when you're surprised. Hooligan is a troublemaker. Honker is a noise. Hoon is someone who goes, loves driving fast. Haru is goodbye. Hospital pass is pass you receiving football that might land you on hospital ward because you're chuck- tackled heavily. A hottie is a hot water bottle that you place in bed when it's cold. Also rel- t- relates to an attractive person. Um, hot under the collar is someone who's angry. How about a quick bite? Let's go and eat now. How are you, mate? How are you? Hump is to have sex. Um, I could eat a horse and chase a jockey means I'm hungry. Um, I need that like I need a hole in the head means I don't need it at all. I reckon is absolutely I smell bacon. I know that, know that the traffic police are around or the cops are around. So you're lining up and waiting for the light to green and you see a cop car behind you, you go, I smell bacon. If he is something that is questionable, it doesn't work. Not good. Not up standard. I'm as dry as a dead dingo's dongo means I'm thirsty. Um, limbo, imbo means imbecile. I'm so hungry I could eat a horse. Eat the ass out of a low flying duck means I'm hungry. Insta is slang for social media. Instagram, I've got a really bad case of trots means I've got diarrhea, meaning you've got to go to the toilet a lot. Um, also, if you put two spoons of corn flour into a normal 250 ml cup, stir it and drink that, that will get rid of your diarrhea. Um, I've got a thirst that you could photograph is a thirsty, um, Iris is teeth, jammies, pajamas, jets, crackers is, is testicles. Jesus bars, those handles that are located in the car ceiling that you hang on to when you're having a riot while ride, you know, the, the handles above you that you hold on to. Jimmy Dancer is a cancer. Joe Bloke is a rhyme slamming for a snake. Uh, journal is a journalist. Jug is electric kettle. Jug's breast. Jump back. Jump back is sheep. Jump up sweater. Jump food. That fast food that's very unhealthy. Um, most people, I don't think many people in America, well, I think they percolate and brew their coffee and a lot of people use the microwave. Um, kangaroos loose on the top paddock means a crazy person. Kaz a Karen. I don't... Okay, I had a bit of issues with recording then, but, uh, who we're up to, I think it was Karen, and I was saying I don't like it, how people are carrying on and saying Karen all the time. JK. Okay, so we're up to Karen. Kaz or Karen. Kara is kerosene. Kerry... Kazza is Kerry. Kick the bucket means to pass away, to die. Okay. So, Kazza is Karen. Kero is kerosene. Kazza is Kerry. Kick the bucket means to die, to pass away. Uh, kindy is kindergarten, generally sort of three to four year old, before, you know, it's before school, preschool. Uh, King Brown is the King Brown snake. I've never hear it, heard it as a 750 bottle of beer. I see Tawley. Okay, a uh, kip is to take a nap. Knackered is very tired. Also means when testicles are removed from one of your pets. So, they will say, as you cat being knackered, you'll say yeah, which means it's been desexed. Um, knickers is female underwear. Uh, yeah. Knob is a penis, person or who's an idiot. Knock, knock, knock back is to refuse something. Knock something is to criticize. Knocked up is pregnant. Knock is his breast. Lappy is laptop. Lark is a joke. Larrikin is a cheeky person. I, d- I haven't heard this as an electric blanket. Lecky is an electrician. It's not an electric blanket. 
Uh, legless is someone who's, person who's extremely drunk. Lemon is something completely useless. Commonly referred to as bad car. So you buy a used car from the car dealer. Within two weeks it starts to break down. So it's called lemon. A lift is either a ride in a car or elevator. Like a rat up a drain pipe is doing something very quickly. Quickly. Liquid amber is beer. Like a shag on a rock is a shag is often a bird that sits by one itself in the ocean. Lingo is Aussie slang for language. Lippy is lipstick. Liquid laugh is a vomit. Liquid lunch is having only beer for lunch. A uh, little Aussie battler is someone who's extreming, experiencing extreme hardship, like most of us. Uh, little boys is frankfurts or cheerios that are little red sausages that are made up from awful face, ears, tail, all those kinds of parts. Uh, uh, little Lily is a small kit. Or, or a rug rat is another one. Uh, live on the smell of an oily rag is to live frugally, or you're almost out of petrol and you just make it to the petrol station. You say it's a servo tenant, I just made it, it was living on an oily rag. It means you're almost out of petrol, the car just made it. Uh, loaded is you have a lot of money, a loaf is ahead. Lobbing is to visit someone, so you just want to go and see someone, so you just lob up. Um, lobster is in a $20 note. That's not right. A $20 note is a red bag. Lolly is a sweet candy. Lolly is a soft drink. No, that's right. Not right. Lolly water is very sweet flavoured pre-mixed alcohol drinks like Southern Comfort and creaming soda. Uh, long, let, it, long neck is a 750ml bottle of beer. That's true. Uh, Lou is toilet. Yes. Another word is Brasco or Dunny. Um, look see is to have a look at something. Loose cannon is someone who is completely out of control. Lug is ears. Lung lolly is a cigarette. Or oh, another nail in the coffin is a cigarette. Uh, lurk is illegal activity. Mac is just McDonald's, the fast food chain. Mad is crazy. Mad is a cut snake is crazy, upset over something. Mad root is someone who likes having lots. Um, or a shager is another name for a mad rooter. Maggie is a magpie bird that can attack and leave stitches in your head. Um, Macar is a Greek wanker for Australia has many people of Greek heritage, so it's used a lot. Fob is another one. I don't mean to be derogatory, but it's just a name that they say. Fob is fresh off the boat. Manchester is sheets and bed sheets and linen. Mango Madness is really hot. Map of Tasmania is women's pubic area, but probably not that relevant these days because everyone is getting a Brazilian wax. A Brazilian wax is to wax off all pubic hair on a woman. Mash is mashed potatoes. Mate is usually, it's not usually mean friends, that's wrong. Mate is usually your, your good friend, your best mate, so this is completely wrong, this one. Whoever wrote this is not really Australian. <laughs> mate rates is discounted services, usually for friends, so you've got an electrician that's a mate and you need some wiring done on your house and you'll say to him, look, can you do it for mate mates rates and I'll buy you a carton of beer and he'll go, yeah, no worries, mate, you just buy all the stuff I need and I'll do it. And meanie is a mean person, yes. Meat hangers is... No, I never heard that. It's budgie smugglers. Metho is methylated spirits. Yes, pure alcohol. Mexican is someone from the border because they all move across the border to Queensland because Queensland is just so lovely. Mickey Mouse can mean both excellent or crap. You decide. Don't really hear that much. Midday. A midi is 285 mils glass of beer in New South Wales. Yes. Mince is hamburger meat. Mm, more so awful. Mongrel is any visit for money flow is women's period. Mula is money, Mozzie is mosquito, mucking around is playing silly games, being silly, that could hurt you. Um, muddy, muddy crab, found in North Australia, we call them mud crabs, we don't call them muddies. Mull, marijuana, muso, musician, munchies is snack like chips, pies, chocolate bars, um, mundated is really drunk, mushies, mushrooms, muzzle, murray. Mischief rates apply to a range of meat goods where you're not quite sure where they come from, including sausages. Most sausages have mystery meat. Nappies is diapers. Um, newbie is a new person at work. A newbie, a new item. Never, never, the outback. Well, never, never is not really that. It's never, never is. Don't do that again. Don't go there. Nibblies is finger food. Nigel is someone who has no friends. Used in the context of Nigel, no friends. And Nipper is a young surf lifesaver. Noggin is your head. No hoper is someone who will never do anything well in life. A loser. Nosh is food. No worries. No problems. Lots of crosses. Tic-tac-toe. Nutty is naked. Also, your birthday suit is another word. Nuff is enough. 
Number cruncher is an accountant. None's nasty, very dry. None out to work something out. Oka, a person from the country. Off my face, very drunk. Off sight of someone who helps you in assistance. Um, off the planet, on drugs. Off your head, you're on drugs, or they're making you out, act out of character. Old cheese, his mother. Old fella, penis. Oldies, your parents. On the nose, very smelly. On the rags, a women's periods. One arm bandits, slot machine, poker machine. One for the road is the last drink at the pub before you go, or they close up at the night. The bartender will say, one for the road, we're closing up. Um, one off is something that's very unique or a kind. On the piss, drinking lots of alcohol or having a session. Having a session is having a cone or a chop. Op shop is an opportunity shop. Second hand or pure pre-used goods can be purchased. Ordinary, um, this can be used uh, to, well, it can mean a excellent or mediocre an example is it can be used in an ironic sense such as you spot an extremely attractive person or he she looks or s is overseas out back of our stray unpopulated interior of australia oxygen thief is someone you don't really uh someone you don't like who doesn't really deserve deserve to be using up all the earth's resources so someone at work you don't like you don't want to offend him you just say oh look at that oxygen thief over there he's just bludgeoning he's doing nothing Oz is Australia. Pack your shit. Um, ah, oh, pack. I'll say pack your shit means pack your shit and go. Um, pack shit is to be very scared. Paralytic is drunk. Parliament house, the toilet. Um, pash, a long passionate kiss or a French kissing. Passion pop is cheap, fizzy alcohol, very popular with teens. Perv is having a long, lustful look at an attractive member. We we'll generally call them pervert, not the opposite sex. Petrol is gasoline fuel. Um, it is someone who loves cars, V8 muscle cars, all that kind of stuff. Pickled is drunk. Piece of piss is very easy. Pifed is thrown away in the bin. Pigs is a dog or two term for policeman. Policeman, pig's ass is, I don't agree with a single thing that you're saying. Pig's ear is a beer. Pig's ear is also a dried out pig's ear that we give to our dogs. Pig out is eating lots of food. A piker is someone who leaves a party or night out early. Pineapple is a $50 note. Pink mitts is a vagina. Pink slip is what you get. When you lose your job, not necessarily. I haven't heard that one. Um, pink slippers, what people in New South Wales have to get yearly um, to register their car to say that the car is roadworthy. Pine is a large glass of beer, usually 500 mils. Piss is urine, also means alcohol. Piss trough is urinal. I thought a pint, I thought that was a schooner that was 500 mil. I thought a pint was 250 mil. Piss, uh, Pistery lolly, uh, the smell disinfectant thing in a urine. I think it's that thing. Piss Ed is an alcoholic. Piss is drunk. Pissed off is angry. Plus is drunk. Piss, uh, plates of meat is feed. Play funny, but to act a silly way. Um, play is straight. Someone who's fair. Um, plonk is cheap wine, like the stuff you found on goon bags. Pluggers is cheap thongs. Well, thongs, which is what you wear on your feet, not thongs as in G-strings. Point Percy at the police, but porcelain is... A man who needs to go to the toilet. Polly or Polly is a politician. This is power machines known as slot machines in the United States. Pommy is an English person that go oh, all that that whinge and pom. Um, Pommy bastard is a term of endowment for English person. Pommy shower is not you actually using a shower with water. It's just rubbing deodorant on yourself. It's called shower in a can as well. Pong is a very bad smell. Poo farm is a sewage treatment plant. Poo men is a plumber. Poo tickets to toilet paper. Pork is to have sex. Porky pies is telling lines. Porno is a pornographic movie. Port is a suitcase or a bag that you take, put your luggage in. A pot is 285 mils of glass. PowerPoint is an electrical outlet. A posi posi is a position. Pram, stroller, to wheel baby around. A prang is a car accident. A posi is a present. Pro, a present. A prostitute. Or also called uh, street walkers, another word in the truck stops, we call them uh, sleeper leapers because they leap from one to another. Uh, pub crawl is to go to all the places to get drink in one night, which is basically going to every pub in town. Pull your head in is to shut up, mind your own business, put a sock in it, shut up, pull the wool over, pull, put on the wobbly boot is to get drunk. Um, quickie is a brief period before sex, no, a quickie is a quick route sex. That's not a brief period for sex. A quick is a quick route, quick sex. A quid is money to make a quid. Um, I haven't heard this rack cocaine. It also means breast. Uh, a rack is also, it means breast or ass. I've never heard it mean cocaine. We don't really have cocaine in 
history. Rack off means to go away. Rad is excellent. Rafferty rules no rules at all. Rage is party. Rage on party all night. Ranger is a redhead. Randy is horny. Raps is extremely happy. Rat ass is drunk. Rat bag is a cheeky person or an idiot. Rat shit is terrible. Red back $20 note. Red Joe is registration. Rello. Relly is a relative. Reggie Digi means true. Ringing is substitute. Rip off is something that's a lot more expensive than it should be. Ripper is excellent. Um, Rip Snorter is another excellent one. Road Train is a truck with multiple trailers. Generally, they have a minimum of three trailers. Can have up to, I think it's six, seven trailers, depending on the truck that's pulling the trailers. A roadie is a beer you have on your way home from pub as it closes. A rock doctor is a geologist. Um, stock up. Uh, rock up is to turn up somewhere uninvited. A root kangaroo root is sex. Root rat is someone who works for a root rat is a wombat that likes to eat root shit and leave. Uh, tired, buggered, stuffed. Ropeable is someone who's very angry. A rolly is a cigarette that you roll yourself like a diary. Well, it is a rolly. Um, a rort, uh, defrauding something, like, what a rort, my boss gave me a check and it bounced, it didn't cash, what a rort, I worked all week and got nothing, you know, um, ropeable. Um, rotten drunk, very drunk, rough nut is a hillbilly, um, never heard of rough nut, but hillbilly, um, rug up is to dress warmly, rug rat is a child or an ankle biter, rumpus room is a recreational family room, pool table, things like that. Runners, trainers, sneakers, rust bucket is a very old car or a bomb. Um, I've never heard Safa, a South African, I've never heard that said. Salty, saltwater crocodiles, uh, Arvo, this afternoon, sand group is someone from Western Australia. Um, Sanger, a sandwich, Savon Blanc is Savon Blanc wine, running and the end of their studies and generally terrorise the whole neighbourhood. It's not more than a week. It generally goes for two weeks. A schooner is full 25 mils of beer. I thought it was 500 mils. A scone is a head. A scone is also... A scone is also this. Hang on. What a scone is. A scone is made flour, water, salt. The most easiest recipe you can make and you chuck it in the oven 45 minutes and you have um, cream and jam and that's delicious with butter. So that's what a scone is. It's not your noggin. I don't know where they got that from. Okay, so a scream is someone who becomes drunk and on not much alcohol. Um, no, generally they're called a cheap drunk, not so much a screamer. A scrubber is a promiscuous worse woman. A scumbag, uh, a used condom. No, a scumbag is someone who is low, uh, rips people off and is generally a low life. I've never heard that as a user. See a man about a dog isn't to urinate, it's about to go and purchase something or go and buy drugs or generally that's what they say. Um, Seppo, sh short rhyming, slang for American, yank, rhymes with septic tank, no, never heard of that. Uh, servo is where you get petrol, gas station, yes, that's correct. Slang, a shake to have sex, yep. Shake. Shaker, someone who likes to shake. Yep, Sharp Biscuit is a surfer that is just starting out. Shazza is shower and a sheep shaker is a New Zealander. Um, she'll be apples is it'll be all good. She'll be right. Um, like a bub is everything will be all right. Or oh, hunky dory. Sheila is a woman. Shindig is a party. Um, shit box is a very old car. Shit face is very drunk. Shit house is something that's really bad or poor quality. Also means toilet. Shit kicker is someone who does unpleasant jobs that no one else wants to do or jobs that barely pay the minimum wage. Shit scared is very scared. Shit, shit sandwich is the raw deal. Raw deal. Shonky is an, um, an item that's not very good quality. There's a customer magazine called Choice which has an annual Shonky Awards which is a dubious honor roll of dodgy products and services. It's actually a government run, um, website and magazine to warn citizens of cheap knockoffs. Slot through, uh, shoot through is to leave somewhere or someone on short notice, you just shoot through. Show pony is someone who likes showing off a lot, such as dressing up by behaving like a peacock or showing off their nice expensive cars that they don't own that the bank owns. Show the ropes is show how some things work around here. So you've got a new 
employee at your work and your boss will walk up to you and he'll say, show him the ropes, mate. Yep, that's what it means. Um, silver pillow is what you sleep on after you're drunk on the gallon of wine that, um, you drunk the wine out of it and you blow it up with your mouth. It's those goon boxes. Um, six pack is six bottles of beer. Skint is broke, no money. Um, skite is to brag about and boast about something. Uh, slag is a promiscuous person or slut. Uh, sloshed is drunk. Spine bashing is resting. Strides is trousers. Um, strine is Australian slang. F is skew. I haven't heard that one. Skimpy is scantily um, clad barmaid, mainly used in Kalgoorlie, Western Australia, not necessarily. Skimpy is used in a term of skimpy bikinis, um, women wearing skimpy outfits that they shouldn't be showing off as much as they do. Uh, skull is to drink a beer very fast or to down a drink very fast is what it means. Slab is 24 cans of beer, which is a carton. Slack is lazy. Smartass is someone who knows everything. A smoko is your coffee break, generally your first break in the morning. Uh, snag bag is a sausage roll. Mystery meat and coast and pastry. Um, we don't call them snag bags. We call them sausage rolls. Uh, place is high on drugs. Uh, spaced out high on drugs, yes. Sparrow's fart is dawn. Speedo is a speedometer on the car. Spread is a large collection of different foods. So you have a party and you got a spread, which is a lot of food out on the table. Uh, sprog is sperm. Sprogs are children. Spewing is really disappointed. Spit the dummy is an overreaction. Um, spruker is someone who's trying to sell you something. Sprung is when you're caught doing something you shouldn't be doing, similar to Buster. Spud is a potato. Spunk is a really good looking person. Ah, Sparky is an electrician. They got it right there. Spill your guts is to reveal a deep secret or to report to the police everything that you've done wrong. Squeeze means to have a squeeze is to have a look. Standover man, usually involved with criminal gangs, gangs and this large guy who threatens someone with physical violence to get his way. Generally, they are debtors with the bikies where people owe them drug money. Um, they're also called enforcers. Um, stalker, stark is naked, stark naked. Steak and kidney is Sydney, so I'm going to steak and kidney tomorrow, which means I'm going to Sydney tomorrow. Sticky beak is someone who's a really nosy person, so you got that neighbour that likes to always sticky beak on everything you're doing from the moment you come home. Stinker is a very hot day. Stone the crows is, I'm amazed. Um, stoked is extremely happy and pleased. Uh, straight up and down is an honest person. Straubs is strawberry. Strayer is short for Strayer. Struth is what a surprise, mate. Um, stonkered, I have never heard that word before. Stonkered, really drunk. Uh, strike a blow to help with something, yep, strike a blow, or strike a blow could also mean that you hit someone and you struck a blow. Uh, strife is trouble, strine is Australian saying, never heard that. Uh, stinger is jellyfish, um, stroppy is someone who has an irritable, irritable mood, see cranky, yes, stroppy, when you're pissed off with someone you become stroppy. Stubby is 375 ml bottle of beer. Stuffed is really tired. Stun mullet is a shocked person. Um, suck it in is to be tricked into something. Sunbake is to sunbathe, is to burn, is to get skin cancer in the future. It's not done anymore, really. Um, a stubby is a subcontractor, a stubby. So you have someone coming over to you, build your house. The electricians and plumbers come in, they're called stubbies. Um, the, the blokes that are building everything else, they're called tradies because they're tradespersons. Sundowner is a beer drunk at sunset. Sunnies are sunglasses. Surfers is people who surf all the time. The dull bludgers are called surfies. Uh, suss it out means to investigate something. Sus is short for suspicious. Sweet as awesome. Swiffy is to be on them. Tar is thank you. Tart fuel is pre-mixed drinks often drunk by women. Um, tacker is a child, a taddy is a tadpole, take a slash means to make fun of some, something or someone, a tolly, 750ml bottle of beer, so many of these are repeating, it's frustrating, I apologise, I really do, I did go over it, but didn't think they would repeat it this often, tanked is really drunk, a tap is a faucet, so where you turn your hot and cold water on.
Okay, so a Taswegan is someone from Tasmania, or we call them a uh, two head is someone from Tasmania. So, yeah, they're called two heads, or we call them Tassie. Uh, tea is dinner, technicolor yawn is the vomit or spew. Telling me dreaming is a quote from the castle mo movie. It's meeting unrealistic expectations, like tell him to dream it, mate, it's never going to happen. Tenor, a ten dollar note, known as a Pavarotti, you know, a tenor. Well, I mainly know him as a blue tongue, I haven't heard that one. Timbin bowling, United States like bowling. Teza is cherry. That one didn't even touch the sides. When you are so thirsty, you swallow what drink in one gulp. The lot means everything. The missus is someone's wife or your wife. You gotta talk to your missus before you buy it. A thingo is a thingamajib or a thing of an item. So, I, I mean, the thingamajig of a thingamajig on the thingamajig is right over there on top of the thingamajig means I left it over on top of the table. It's right there in front of you. Have a look, open your eyes. Um, thongs, flip flops is not thongs as in g-strings it's thongs is what you put on your feet throw down is a very small bottle of beer you can throw down your throat quickly known as grenades thunderbox is toilet tickets on yourself is to having a high opinion of yourself tight ass a stringy person is someone who's very tight with their money tin lids is a rhyming slang for kids a tinny uh tin of beer also means a small aluminium boat Tip is a garbage dump. Toasty, toasted sandwich, which is generally ham, cheese, and tomato. Australian's favourite toasty sandwich. Uh, togs, swim sweet, or cozies, mainly. Um, <coughs> togs is, yeah. A tool, idiot, also means penis. I haven't heard that one. Um, to right <coughs> is, I definitely agree, top end Northern Territory. And believe it or not, Australia has a lot of camels here in Australia, and they're one of the most purest, purebred camels in the world because they were brought over from Egypt after World War II and left to um, go wild in the desert. They're importing them back over to um, Saudi Arabia. <coughs> so a torch is a flashlight, Trachydax is a tracksuit, <coughs> Trady is a tradesperson like a plumber, carpenter, Trainee is a transvestite or a transistor radio like your ham radio. A tree hugger is an environmentalist, see greenie. Trolley is a shopping cart or those small little uh, Asian import cars like Kia Rios and Suzuki Swifts. They're called shopping carts as well. Uh, trolley is very drunk. Trucky is a truck driver or a steering wheel attendant is another word for a truck driver. True blue means patriotic, genuine. Yes, it's, it's real. Taka, taka food, um, terps, turpentine, it's also a means of an alcoholic drink, i.e., oh, you're on the terps, going to get drunk, yep, on the terps tonight, mate. Two up is a gambling game played on Anzac Day, it's the only day that you're allowed to play it, it's illegal every other day. Ugg boots are sheepskin lined boots to keep your feet warm in winter, known as Uggies, and they don't just wear them in winter, they wear them everywhere now, it's sad. Um, under the weather means hungover or not feeling well. Uni is university. Unit also means a flat. Up the duff is pregnant. Up shit's creek means in trouble. Or up shit's creek without a puddle means you're in deep trouble without any way of getting out. Up yourself, himself, herself is someone who has an extremely high opinion of themselves. These people usually have delusions of grandeur context that he was up himself, that he was coming out the other end, um, another word is generally saying they've got a 10 foot pole up their ass. Your yeah, uterus is a utility wagon or a car. I've never heard a ute being called that. We call them a ute, not a uterus, a ute. Um, we got VW is a Volkswagen car or we go punch buggy. A vego is a vegetarian. Veggies is vegetable. Veranda is balcony. We generally call them balconies. Um, wagon school is the skip school for the day, or truant, or, um, walk of shame is wearing the same clothes in the morning that you've worn out after being, after a big night before, also when you're leaving someone's place, um, where you've just slept with them, like my crazy mate did after a non Asians with a cricket, lady on a cricket oval. Uh, Wally is a fool or an idiot, or also a, uh, kangaroo. A wanker is someone who masturbates, an idiot, yeah, generally it's an idiot, a wanker, you know, someone cuts you off in traffic, you give them the forfeit, you know, the bird salute and call them a wanker. 
um, wanted to chew my arm off, you feel like doing that when you've just slept with someone you really didn't want to, or um, I wanted to chew my arm off. I was in a meeting with my boss and I couldn't get out of it and I just wanted to chew my arm off for a reason to get out of it. Water the horses is to urinate. Waxhead is a surfer. Another word for a surfer is a skeg. Weak as piss is weak. No strength. They're all talk and, you know, they they can't do anything. Weaker than a sub, sunburned snowflake is very weak. Never heard that one, really. Wearing the brown underpants is you need these when you're really, really scared. Well, generally wearing the brown underpants is you wear your undies one way for a couple of days and then you flip them over and flip them out and then you wear them the other way for another couple of days. That's wearing the brown undies. Weekend warrior is someone who work, works around the house on the weekend. No, a weekend warrior is someone who gets on a motorbike wearing thongs, flip-flops, and no protection for their skin at all. They just wear shorts and shirts and no leathers or anything else like that. That is what a weekend warrior is. It isn't someone who works on their house. It is an idiot that gets on a motorbike and a road motorbike and then gets out in the traffic and then gets in an accident and emergency services have to scrape them off the road because they want to be a weekend warrior and not wear any leather protection or any protection on a motorbike. <clears throat> so that's what a weekend warrior is. Westie is someone from Western Sydney or more so Westie is also a name for someone with the last name West um, and it also means out back west but there is a lot of people in west and they get called Westy. What's the John Dory means? What's the story or what's the ghost? Um, a, wine, a whinge is to whine, to whine about what job you've got to do. Um, white ant, to criticise someone. No, uh, a white ant is a termite that eats wood and eats everything. So um, that's not to criticise someone. Um, yeah. White pawners are great white sharks, also means topless females at the beach. A wife beater is a dark blue signet, singlet, never heard that one. Uh, wino is an alcoholic who drinks lots of cheap wine or plonk, yep, and you can pick them out by their red nose. A wino always has a red nose, no matter what, <coughs> excuse me, what they do, they have a red nose, you can tell them. Excuse me, you can tell a wino from their red nose. A wog, um, a flu or virus of some description, also a person of Mediterranean orange, origin, e.g. Italian or Greek. That's why they call them fresh off the boat, because fogs, wogs. Wombat, someone who eats roots and leaves, likes lots of sex. Wonky is something that is very unsteady or not made of good quality. Whoop whoop is an isolation location like the outback, out in the middle of whoop whoop. On them if they're on fire, it means you don't care about someone that they've upset you that much that you couldn't care if they were on fire, you let them burn. Wowzer, a very boring, extremely conservative person, never heard of that. Uh, Risty, to masturbate, never heard of that. Um, generally it's Mrs. Palmer, go and see Mrs. Palmer. Um... Uh, Wuss, a weak-spirited person, yeah, wuss, but we don't really say that. Um, forex is pronounced forex, xxx, it's the beer produced in Brisbane here in Queensland, and no, it's not because we can't spell forex. Um, yabba yabba is to talk a lot. Yabby is freshwater crayfish, a crustacean you can eat, it's like crab. Yank, to throw up, no, uh, yank is an American, yeah. Yeah, yak. I have a note, yak to throw up, sorry. Yeah, nah, it means, no, nah, it's not, um, yeah, yeah no, nah, I'm not doing it. It doesn't mean, um, it means, yeah, no, nah, I'm not doing that. Yobbo is an unclothed, unintelligent person, usually a male. No, um, there are females as well as male. A yobbo is generally a homeless person. You have an opinion about something, your shout, it's your turn to buy a drink for me, or you have to shout the bar. Use is plural of you. Um, Zach, not worth anything. Zed, how to say the letter Z? Zilch, zilch, Z uh, zilch, yeah, hang on. Someone asked for a, um, pineapple, um, which is a $50 note. And you go, no, mate, I'm broke, I got zilch, zero, zilcho, nothing, which means nothing, I'm broke. A zit is a pimple, zonked is tired. So, that's just one 
I wanted to share, speak. Some people say they can't understand us Australians on what we say or speak. Um, there were a few that I did pick up that weren't mentioned. A mech is a mechanic. Um, uh, Bricky is a bricklayer. Jax is cop. These is detectives. Fireys are the firemen. Um, shit kicker is a low page way. I think that was said. Um, a chippy is a carpenter. Tides out is when you say you make a cup of coffee or you pour a beer and it's not quite up to the top. So you'll say, gee, the tide's out, which means can I have a bit more poured into it? Bangers and mass is is sausages and mashed potato with fried onion and gravy. Um, she'll be right means it's going to be okay. Beauty means good. No worries is easy. Um, to spit the dummy means to crack a shit. Skippy is an Australian. Dilly gaff. Now, I don't know if you've ever heard of dilly gaff, but dilly gaff means do I look like I give a... F U C K. So, dilly gaff. Do I look like I give a fuck? That's what it means. Um, bugger is another one that we use when we stuff up or say we drop something. Instead of swearing, we go bugger. Uh, there's a famous ad uh, with bugger. Um, Mueller, Doe, Bugsy is money. Uh, yeah, I said the one before, um, someone's telling you lies, or furfies, which is lies, and you say, um, you better wipe the corner of your mouth because there's still some bullshit left, shit left in there. Um, someone that's always talking and never shuts up is called have a chat. Um, another word for someone that won't shut up, you'll say, have you got verbal diarrhea? And verbal diarrhea basically means that they never shut up, they, they're always talking. Um, yeah, um, useless at a set of tits on a bull. Well, there's no tits on a bull, is there? Um, a cupper is a cup of coffee. Um, so yeah, I've, I think I've said most of them. Chook is chicken. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, a ranger is red. I think I said that. I did my hair before. I don't know. It's getting so long. I've been trying to decide whether I cut it, but it's down past my hips now. It's quite long. So if I did decide to cut it, I think I would donate it to people that make wigs for Council Council. So yeah, if you're still with me and you you enjoy this, hit the like and. Just something different because all we're hearing is stuff about political and that, but I just wanted to explain some of the words that we use. We use most of these words in our daily life, so thank you for watching wherever you are in the world. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. Raise your vibrations and wherever you are, much love. And be safe for watching. Bye.